hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel um so on today's video i'm going to make the hello fresh barbecue pulled chicken burgers um last time i made the i made with lewis the sausage ones but obviously it didn't go as, as well and this video has been requested so i'm gonna make it so i've got the recipe here and then i've got all the how to make it at the back so i'll show you what ingredients i'm using so we've got the 600 grams of chicken thighs of chili uh, the burger buns, we've got um, potatoes, lettuce, a carrot, three barbecue sauce sachets, barbecue sauce, sorry, sachets, and 150 ml of water. So, this is the barbecue sauce. I've put three sachets of barbecue sauce in there. Um, half a packet of vinegar it's only this small packet so half of that and then I've put my chilies in there as well so I'm waiting for this to boil through now and then I am going to add the chicken and let it simmer in there for about 15 to 20 minutes and in the meantime I'm going to put these wedgies into the oven it's a bit hard to video how oh my hair's gone in the pan um yeah so basically i've put the chicken on now and it is boiling so what i'm going to do now is put the wedges in my preheated oven i managed to burn myself as well so what i'm going to do is put the wedges on a tray spread them all out i'm going to add some salt And then I'm also going to put some oil on. And then I'm just going to mix it all in. It's just so they reach the dark spot. But yeah, so these will go in the oven for about 25 minutes. And while the, these are cooking and the chicken's cooking, I am going to make like the slaw. This is what the chicken looks like in the barbecue sauce. Um, I'm just going to cover that up. The potatoes are in the oven. And now I'm going to do the baby lettuce and the carrot. This is the salad it's got obviously lettuce and carrots then the chicken is proper boiling there and then we've got 22 minutes left for the wedges so what i'm going to do is season the salad now and then i'll move on to the next bit this is so hard to so yeah i've got my salad here i'm just going to add some salt and pepper to it if it comes out yeah. i'm just going to add some salt well that was pepper and then some salt So that's just to go on the side. But you see what I mean? That's like proper healthy because obviously you've got um you've got the salad as the side. Obviously, not everyone likes salad, so it's not the ideal thing for everyone, but to me it is. So what I'm waiting now is for the wedges. So when there's five minutes to go, I'm gonna cut these bones up and put them in the oven for about five minutes up until the wedges are ready. And then when the chicken is done, I'm gonna try and shred it into like small piece as much as like as small as they can get. Um, it is hard to film a cooking video when you're by yourself because you are constantly like moving around and everything. But yeah, um, that's it really. I think it will be ready in about 15 to 20 minutes. Um, and to be honest, it's gonna turn out really nice because it smells really good and everyone loves burgers, so. <laughs> So this is my shredded chicken. I only used two forks to do it because it was really easy to pull apart. Like if it wasn't hot, you could do it by <laughs> your fingers. So yeah, everything's in the oven now. Well, the wedgies are in the oven and so are the buns for five minutes. The, like I showed you, the chicken has been shredded. So I'm gonna return that back into the pan just to get a bit more sauce on it. And then I'll just need to get the plate ready, really. So people, this is the end result of the burgers. 
So it's like that, barbecue pulled pork, lettuce, and then we've got your salad and some of the wedgies on the side. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video as I've enjoyed making it. Um, I'm really excited to try them because it does smell really nice and I have tried a bit of the chicken and it does taste really good. Um, so yeah, that's what the food looks like. Um, let me know in the comments what you think about it and yeah, I'll see you in my next one.